The Major League Baseball All-Star Game has come and gone, and the owners of the Baltimore Orioles franchise in Baltimore and Maryland officials have not hammered out a lease agreement keeping the baseball team in the city beyond the season. The Orioles' ownership and the Maryland Stadium Authority lease agreement is set to end on December 31, 2023. There seems to be state money available to fix up the Camden Yard Stadium, about $600 million worth of public funding, but there seems to be a hold. The Orioles' ownership wants to develop the land around the stadium and have a stadium village. In that area, there's a baseball park, football stadium, and the Inner Harbor, which features a seaport, restaurants, and museums. The Maryland governor, Wes Moore, and the baseball business released a statement claiming both sides are committed to keeping the team in Baltimore. What comes next for the Camden Yards campus must serve our entire community and the city as a whole. From the ballpark and surrounding neighborhoods to Harbor Place in the Inner Harbor, we are committed to making the downtown corridor a premier destination that benefits Baltimore and Maryland residents year-round. We have shared ideals to create a thriving and inclusive Baltimore, not just for the Orioles, but for those who call it home. Orioles ownership said no to a five-year lease extension earlier this year, hoping to get the stadium village done as part of a long-term deal. Baltimore Mayor Brandon Scott said, This is not about leaving Baltimore. I will say this again. John Angelos, the Orioles, are not leaving Baltimore City. They are going to be at Camden Yards. We want to see at Camden Yards what you see around other ballparks. More development, more activation, more things happening. The stadium game is playing out in Baltimore. I'm Evan Weiner.